Hello, this is BP Lab. Last time we made a playable wooden piano using Scratch. Today, we will use Scratch to create a wooden drum that can be actually played. So, how can we make these wooden drums sound like real drums? That is, using the properties of a conductor to send an electrical signal to a computer. By attaching a conductive material to the drum, if the drum is touched by the hand, an electrical signal is sent to the computer, and a drum sound is generated according to the signal. So, as a first step, let's make a conductive wooden drum. Here's the list of materials to make a wooden drum. Drum frame Makey Makey board USB mini 5 pin cable Wood glue Alligator clips Jumper wires Copper tape And aluminum tape Wood glue can also be replaced with double-sided tape or a hot glue gun. First, take off all the drum shapes from the wooden frame. The large circle in the middle is the bass drum of the drums. And from the left, hi-hat, snare drum, low tom, and crush cymbal. Cut aluminum tape larger than the size of the drum and wrap it around it. And, we're going to create a path for the signal to be sent from the drum to the computer. Cut the copper tape into five pieces of appropriate length. Enough to cover the height of the drum, attach the copper tape to the drum frame. Apply wood glue to attach the drum model wrapped in aluminum tape to the frame. If you attach all the frames, the electric drum is complete. Then, let's connect the drums and the computer using the Makey Makey board. Now, let's connect the drums and the computer so that they can make sounds. The Makey Makey board converts drum touches into signals and transmits them to the computer. First, plug the USB cable into the computer and connect the Makey Makey board to the other end of the USB cable. A blinking light on the board indicates a successful connection. Attach an alligator clip to the earth at the bottom of the Makey Makey board. Plug the jumper wires into the left side of the board, that will be responsible for the five sounds of the drum. Connect jumper wires and alligator clips, and connect wooden drums and alligator clips, electronic drum is complete. Then, let's program the drum sound to match the touches. Before programming, you will need a scratch file with drum sounds. The file can be saved by accessing the website and then clicking the download button on the drum sound code. So let's start programming. Access the site to get started with scratch. When the page opens, click create. 
In this file and menu, click Load from your computer. Click the downloaded project file to open the project. Click on the Sounds tab to make sure all five drum sounds are included. Click the Code tab. Click the Events tab and get the When Space key pressed block. To change the input to fit the A bass drum, change Space to EW. Click on the Sound tab. Get the Start Sound Bass Drum block. Program the rest of the drums in the same way. When you complete the five blocks as shown on the screen, the drum programming is complete. So, shall we play the drums? Let's hold the alligator clip connected to earth with one hand and play the drum with the other hand. So far, we've made electronic drums, programmed sounds, and even played them. With Scratch, you can create and play a variety of musical instruments, such as a piano or xylophone. Then, next time, I'll see you all with a different instrument.